Rise and shine, Mr. Freeman. Rise and shine. Not that I wish to imply you have been sleeping on the job. No one is more deserving of a rest, and all the effort in the world would have gone to waste until... Well, let's just say your hour has come again. The right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world. So wake up, Mr. Freeman. Wake up and smell the ashes. You have chosen, or been chosen, to relocate to one of our finest remaining urban centers. I thought so much of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here, in the Citadel so thoughtfully provided by our benefactors. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. And so, whether you are here to stay or Passing through on your way to parts stuff, unknown. It's all I have left. Welcome to City 17. All right, I'm moving. Jeez. It's safer here. Welcome. Were you the only Welcome ones on that to train? City 17. You have chosen, or been chosen, to relocate to one of our finest remaining urban centers. I thought so much of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here, in the Citadel so thoughtfully provided by our benefactors. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. And so, whether you... Don't drink the water. They put something in it to, to make you forget. I don't even remember how I got here. Well, to City 17. It's They're always safe. departing, but they never arrive. And the ones that do arrive, they, they never leave. You never see them go. They're always full. No one ever gets on, but they're always, they're always departing, but they never arrive. And the ones that do arrive, they never leave. I see, they took your suitcase, too. They can't get away with this much longer. I'm working up the nerve to go on. Welcome 
Dr. Green again? I was hoping I'd seen the last of him in City 14. I wouldn't say that too loud. This is his base of operations. I thought so much of City 17 that I elected to establish my administration here in the city of so far provided by our benefactors. I've been proud to call City 17 my home. And so, whether you are here to stay or passing through on your way to parts unknown, welcome to City 17. It's safe for you. Got a standard relocation coupon just like everybody else. It's me, Gordon. Barney from Black Mesa. Hey, sorry for the scare. I had to put on a show for the cameras. I've been working undercover with civil protection. I can't take too long or they'll get suspicious. I'm way behind on my beating quota. Yes, Barney, what is it? I'm in the middle of a critical test. Sorry, Doc, but look who's here. Great Scott! Gordon Freeman! I expected more warning. Yeah, you and me both, Doc. He was about to board the express to Nova Prospect. Well, Barney, what do you intend? I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Alex is around here, somewhere. She would have a better idea how to get him here. Well, as long as he stays away from checkpoints, we should be okay. Listen, I gotta go, Doc. We're taking enough chances as it is. Very well. And, uh, Gordon? Good to see you. Okay, Gordon. You're gonna have to make your own way to Dr. Kleiner's lab. Oh, man, that's what I was afraid of. Get in here, Gordon, before you blow my cover. Pile up some stuff to get through that window and keep going till you're in the plaza. I'll meet up with you later. Consider the fact that for the first time ever, as a species, immortality is in our reach. This simple fact has far The line starts at the end. It requires radical rethinking and 
I don't know about you, but I'm ready to join civil protection just to get a decent meal. You gotta be damn hungry to wait in line for this crap. that run in direct opposition to our neural precincts. I find it helpful at times like these to remind myself that our true enemy is instinct. Instinct was our mother when we were an infant species. Instinct coddled us. It was safe in those hard scrabble years when we hardened our sticks and cooked our first meals of the meat of fire and started at the shadows that leapt upon the cavern's walls. But inseparable from instinct is its dark twin, superstition. Instinct is inextricably bound to unreasoning impulses. And today we clearly see its true nature. Instinct has just become aware of its we can't be seen talking to each other. And like a cornered beast, it will not go down without a bloody fight. No town. Instinct you? would inflict a fatal injury on our species. Instinct creates its own oppressors and bids us rise up against them. Instinct tells us that the unknown is a threat rather than an opportunity. Instinct slyly and covertly compels us away from change and progress. Instinct, therefore, must be expanded. It must be fought tooth and nail, beginning with the basest of human urges, the urge to reproduce. fit to suppress our reproductive cycle. Sincerely, a concerned citizen. Thank you for writing, sir. Of course, your question touches on one of the starts. First the building, then the whole block. They have no reason to come to our place. Don't worry, they'll find one. If you're looking for a place to stay, you better keep going.
Was that you knocking? I didn't even know we still had a door. Oh, I thought you were a cop. He's one of us. I told you they'd be coming for us next. Just this once, I hope you're wrong. It anymore. Oh, it's gonna be okay. What are we going to do? Do we think there's something? When is it all going to end? Don't worry. Please. It's all right. Instinct. Instinct was our mother. We were species. Attention, residents. Miscount detected in your block. Cooperation with your civil protection team. Permit full ration reward. Hey, you! In here! Head for the roof! There's no time to lose! Here they come! Get in here, quick! Dr. Freeman, I presume. I'd better hurry. The Combine can be slow to wake, but once they're up, you don't want to get in their way. Dr. Kleiner said you'd be coming this way. <laughs> I don't think it occurred to him that you might not have a map. My father worked with you back in Black Mesa. I'm sure you don't remember me, though. Man, a few words, aren't you? Remember him from Black Mesa? Your old administrator. <laughs> don't get my dad started on Dr. Breen. Here. 
Funny you showing up on this day in particular. We've been helping people escape the city on foot. It's a dangerous route to my father's lab through the old canals. Today, we're finally on the verge of having a better way. <laughs> Here, let me buy you a drink. Oh, and by the way, nice to finally meet you. Blast that little... Where did she get to? Lamar! Come out of there! Uh-oh, everything all right, Dr. Kleiner? Oh, uh, hello, Alex. Well, uh, almost all right. Lamar has gotten out of her crate again. If I didn't know better, I'd suspect Barney of trapping and... My goodness. Gordon Freeman. It really is you, isn't it? I found him wandering around outside. Bit of a troublemaker, isn't he? We owe a great deal to Dr. Freeman, even if trouble does tend to follow in his wake. I must say, Gordon, you come at a very opportune time. Alex has just installed the final piece for our resurrected teleport. I can't take any credit for the breakthrough, Doctor. Nonsense. Your talents surpass your loveliness. <laughs> Let's just see if this thing works, okay? Well, is it here? There you are. Man, Gordon, you stirred up the hive. We can't keep him here long, Doc. It'll jeopardize everything we've worked for. Don't worry. He's coming with me. That's right, Barney. This is a red-letter day. We'll inaugurate the new teleport with a double transmission. You mean it's working? For real this time? Because I still have nightmares about that cat. No, no. There's nothing to be nervous about. What cat? We've made major strides since then. Major strides. What cat? Doc, since he's not taking the streets, you might as well get him out of his civvies. What? Oh, dear. You're right. I almost forgot. Barney? I'll give you the honor. <laughs> I've got to get back on my ship, but okay. Here we go. Ah, damn it, get it off me! Lamar, there you are. I thought you got rid of that pest. Certainly not. Never fear, Gordon. She's debeaked and completely harmless. The worst she might do is attempt to couple with your head, <laughs> fruitlessly. Get that thing away from me! Here, yeah, my pet. Hop up. No, not up there! No, no! Careful, Lamar. Those are quite fragile! Oh, fie. It'll be another week before I can coax her out of there. Yeah, longer if we're lucky. <laughs> Barney, you're not an animal person. <laughs> Well, Gordon, go ahead. Slip into your suit now. Well, Gordon, I see your HEV suit still fits you like a glove. At least, the glove parts do. I've made a few modifications, but I'll just acquaint you with the essentials. Now, let's see. <clears throat> the Mark V hazardous environment suit has been redesigned for comfort and utility. Oh, dear. Doc, we don't have time for this. Meanwhile, let's get this show on the road. Gordon, 
why don't you position yourself near the panel over there and wait for my word? Isaac, are you there? Yes, yes, Eli. Bit of a hold up on this end. You'll never guess who found his way into our lab this morning. Uh, that's not who I think it is. Indeed it is, and it's our intention to send him packing straight away in the company of your lovely daughter. Are you ready for us, Dad? We're all set on this end. Then let's do it. Let's see. The massless field flux should self-limit, and I've clamped the manifold parameters to zero base and LT orbifold. No particular Conditions could hardly be more ideal. That's what you said last time. Hey, uh, yeah, about that cat. Initializing in three... One. No, fix sneaks. What now? Uh, Dr. Plug. Uh, dear me, you're right. Gordon, would you mind plugging? Excellent. You gonna let Gordon throw the switch? Gordon, go right ahead. The switch, Dr. Freeman. Very good. Final sequence. Commencing now. I can't look. Uh, <laughs> okay. Oh, it's oh, oh, no! Well, did it work? See for yourself. Hey, Doc. <sighs> Thank goodness. My relief is almost palpable. Fantastic work, is it? Well, I can't take all the credit. Dr. Freeman proved an able assistant. Let's go ahead and bring Gordon through now. Right you are. Speak to you again in a few moments. Good job, Gordon. Throwing that switch and all. I can see your MIT education really pays for itself. All right, Barney. Your turn. Gee, thanks. Gordon, as soon as you're in position, we'll send you to Eli's. And not a moment too soon. Excellent. Initializing in three, two, one. Uh, Barney, if you'd be so kind. Good luck out there, Gordon. Yes, indeed. We're ready to project you, Gordon. Bon voyage, and best of luck in your future endeavors. Final sequence. What the hell? What is it? It's your pet of freaking headhopper! Rawr! I'm not sure. It seems to be some kind of interference. Gordon, stay put. We'll get you out of there. Something is drawing him away. What's the meaning of this? Who are you? How did you get in here? Hey, hey, get back. I'm getting him out of there. You can't just wait into the field. It will kill you apart. Just lost, Gordon. What's going on? I wish I knew. I'm encountering unexpected interference. Don't worry, Gordon. We'll... There he is. Oh, he's been losing it again. I'm all but certain it was Gordon Freeman. He's not there. He didn't come through. Then where is he? Behind you. Shut it down. Shut it down. Gordon, you must get out of here. Get down out of sight. I'll come find you. Hey, Gordon! The Citadel's on full alert. I've never seen it lit up like that. Get out of City 17 as fast as you can, Gordon. Take the old canals, right? They'll get you to Eli's lab. It's, it's a dangerous route, but there's a whole network of refugees, and they'll help you if they can. I'd come with you, but I gotta look after Dr. Kleiner. 
Oh, and before I forget, I think you dropped this back in Black Mesa. Good luck out there, buddy. You're gonna need it.
God! Guess those sirens are for you, huh? Good thing you found us. You're not the first to come through here by This is the free man. The Combine's reckoning has come. Look, we're just a lookout for the Underground Railroad. Main station's right around the corner. They'll get you started on the right foot. Meanwhile, let my Vortigaunt friend here give you a jolt to get you going. Be careful now. We really can't afford to get noticed. Civil protection catches you down here. It's bad news for the whole railroad. We serve the soul. Mr. J. Get out of here. Thank you. 